guys, we're here at VidCon Pop in Anaheim, California, and we're here with... Mandy Rain. So how are you today? I'm doing great. The energy is so fierce here. It's so bomb. Like, I love it. Everyone's so, like, hyped and happy, and it's awesome. I love it. I'm excited. I have a lot of energy. I've had a lot of energy all day, so I'm kind of just rolling with it. <laughs> So for our viewers who don't know you, can you tell us a little bit about yourself? Sure. I'm originally from Nickelodeon School Girls. Um, I'm Mandy Rain with the short hair, the girl that was super awkward in School Girls uh, with Justin Bieber. Um, I was signed to Island Def Jam, and now I just released my EP. My third single is coming out. Sirius XM just put my single in rotation, so everything's going great. I'm Mandy. I'm Christian. I like dogs. Um, I have two brothers now. <laughs> So there's your life story. <laughs> you can keep, keep it going if you want. Right? Yeah, you want to keep going? No, I'm good. That's <laughs> enough. <laughs> so how did you first get into singing? Um, it all started when I was probably about like, I mean, I've been singing since I could remember. It's been a long time, um, but I kind of just got into it because I auditioned for Nick Cannon's project called Star Camp, and that put me on Nickelodeon, which led to the School Girls project. So from there, yeah, that was, that was about it. Who's your biggest inspiration? Ooh, um, I'm actually, I just, I'm super obsessed. You guys aren't going to know who she is because she's like, she's a generation past, but her name is Debbie Gibson and she had a song called Shake Your Love. She's from like the 80s and 90s and I'm actually working with her, but she's like the woman who started pop music. So like, like it was like right as Madonna was hitting, but like there were actual fangirls and like super fans, like she's the person who started it. So I'm like super pumped to be working with her because she like paved the way for pop music and I think it's so cool so yeah she's my inspiration <laughs> okay so any new songs projects upcoming shows anything yes my single back to, my third single back to bad off the riot EP which you can get on iTunes is coming out this fall along with the music video um, so I'm excited about that uh, I have shows all the time just check my Twitter and yeah okay. can you give us your social media so our followers can Followers. Of course, my Twitter is Real Mandy Rain. My Instagram is The Mandy Rain. My Facebook is The Mandy Rain. My YouTube is Real Mandy Rain. <laughs> All right, Mandy Rain. <laughs> no, rain, rain. Okay, stop. <laughs> All right, thank you so much. Thank you guys for having me. I'm glad we got to do this. Yes. Yes. Been waiting for so long. Well, actually, I've been waiting. Wait, I lied. There's fan questions. Oh, fan questions. Fan questions. You guys. All right. The fans. Okay, so shout out to Music Queen B. Shout out to Music Queen V. Okay, if you could go back home, back in time, sorry, what is one piece of advice you would tell your younger self? Do not fall in love with stupid boys. Yeah. That's the one thing that I always say. But you know what? It makes really great songs. But you know, it's like you learn things about yourself as you're going through, especially being in the industry and having relationships. It's like, you know, you learn so much about what you want and don't want in a man or in a boy for you know, lack of a better term, and it's like, I'd say probably don't be so gullible. I know it's like hard to say, because it's like you want to give your whole heart and like trust, but like don't trust these hoes. They not loyal. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, shout out to at Fungan83. Shout out to Fungan83. <laughs> Is, if you can do it with anyone, who would it be? Oh, um, well, hopefully Debbie, like I said. Um, other than that, I'd probably have to say, I really, really love Iggy Azalea, and there's not a lot of people that do, but I think she's super rad, so I'm going to say Iggy. She's cool. We're big, big booty blondes, so I'm going to say Iggy. Okay, there's not a Twitter name for this, but how did you come up with your name, Mandy Rain? Um, actually, Nick Cannon gave it to me. Well, technically he gave it to me, but um, it originally formed because my mom was going to name me Rain when I was a baby, but my dad was like, no, it's too, like, eclectic, and it's too weird, and let's do something typical. So they named me Mandy, but now we're doing, like, the whole Mandy Rain thing, and I, we were sitting in a meeting, and Nick was like, you need a cool name. Like, what can we do? And I was like, well, I was going to be named Rain, so we just connected the two. Okay. All right, shout-out to Mandy Rain fans, too. Shout-out to Mandy Rain fans, too. What is your biggest pet peeve? Ooh. I always get asked this question and I never have answers. Um, I don't like cocky people. I don't like people that are cocky. I think confidence is one thing, but I don't like dealing with like cocky people. I like warm people, you know? Like, I think that, I mean, not, not being cocky, like I just said that, but I think I'm very like real, so it's like dealing with people that are cocky and fake bothers me. Okay, and last one, shout out to Secret Life SL. 
Shout out Secret Life SL. Who's your hero? Ooh, my mom. She's the bomb. I mean, my grandpa is very, it means a lot to me. He passed away from cancer. He battled it for like 10 years, but my mom. I mean, she's just so strong and powerful and has made me into the person I am. And like, I couldn't have asked for anything better. So. I agree. Yeah. All right, now we're done with now the interview. Now we're done. Yeah. <laughs>